have to understand that with absolute strength and absolute power, from a training perspective, we've got to take our athlete somewhere which is not comfortable. But ultimately, it's about these guys. Where does absolute strength fit in for a basketball player? Where does absolute strength fit in for a taekwondo player? And what does that absolute strength look like? The absolute key to training is transfer. There's lots of different tools in the box and there's no one tool fits all. You need to use all your tools to get the job done accurately. It comes back to, first and foremost, the mentality. Trying to push the thresholds and the boundaries of what our athlete's absolute strength expression is. If you manage the intensity progressively, people will get stronger. Getting people strong is not that hard.